a grim scene inside a normally quiet Las Vegas apartment complex. That's what police found Monday morning after a man's brother called 911. Police vehicles, yellow tape, crime scene investigator trucks were all telltale signs that something terrible had likely happened. And when a man's brother went to check on him at the Loreto and Palacio apartments, what he found was a tragedy of the worst kind. He made entry into the house and observed several individuals inside the house suffering from gunshot wounds. In what Metro Police are calling a likely murder-suicide, a man, a woman, and two children, both under the age of 14, were found dead inside. Police say the man likely shot the three victims before turning the gun on himself. A third child, who was clinging to life, police say, was also shot and taken to University Medical Center. At 11.15, our school was announcing that we would be going on a soft lockdown. Nick Tuma lives at the apartment complex recently. and walks to work every day to nearby Thompson Elementary, which was put on a soft lockdown late Monday morning. It's really scary to be in this situation like this. No, I really don't know too much about the complex. There. Minerva Gonzalez has lived in this northwest neighborhood for about a year. It's surprising, you know, when things like this happen. Police did not offer details about the man's relationship with the victims other than to say there was a connection and that it's not a random crime. When contacted by Channel 13 this evening, a UMC spokesman said he didn't have any information about the third juvenile's condition. Reporting from the Northwest Las Vegas Valley, I'm Brian Horwath.